Hello, hello everyone! Welcome to my YouTube channel, it's Marta here and it looks that I'm starting for the fourth time. We had post uh, men coming, we had someone ringing me on Facebook, so I hope this time I managed to... Uh, hi Emily! <laughs> I have a little visitor in my studio because it's first day of holidays, no school. Emily is uh, rock painting, she has yeah. a new passion, she said. Passion for, for stones, is it? Yes. And she's painting, uh, you can show it to everyone. Um, look at that super cutie little stone strawberry. strawberry. You have to do tutorial on it, maybe. How about that on your YouTube channel? I painted another one. Yes, you can show it. We're going to be talking about unlocking the art block today. Uh, we will do some exercise. Oh, look at that avocado. Super cute, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It is super cute, Emily. And who loves it the most? Hannah. And who just woke up? Hannah. <laughs> I cannot believe it! Let's just quickly do this introduction. Why did I call the whole uh, series Unlock the Art Block? I'm looking actually at my... Um, here, uh, on, uh, it's written on my page because mm -hmm. we had uh, all kinds of names for this series and you helped me to choose it and I decided to call it Unlock the Art Block. I think the biggest uh, struggle for people is to start and also we are frozen, we are freezing when it comes to uh, starting and you thinking about already finished project. So this series is going to be kind of reversed uh, process. We are going to be focusing on exercising, on freeing our hands, on uh, trying out new things, new techniques, new products, things we have never tried, never used. We're not going to be thinking about finished piece, about uh, how to do the focal point. Uh, no, we actually will be focusing on techniques, on different things, maybe fun stuff, maybe things that uh, will be challenging childish sometimes but why not why not to be childish definitely experimenting that's the that's the plan for me anyway what else I wanted to say about the series I really hope it's gonna be something for those who really are blocked that you just don't know where to begin you don't feel like start you don't feel like begging so I hope this will be it I'm not gonna be concentrating on uh, expensive products on products in general that you need to have this and that and this and that quite opposite use what you have if it's uh, only as household items you have we're gonna try and learn how to exchange things how to substitute things and definitely I will be trying to implement as many different tools products techniques as possible yes go on you can get her <laughs> uh, so this is what uh, we will finish today it's, it looks kind of finished project, but really it's not. I, well, it is, but really we've used so much fun techniques, so many fun techniques here, uh, different really ways of creating. I'm trying to challenge myself as well. I'm trying to show you things that you can do without being stressed. I really hope that you can sit and relax and just just enjoy the arts, enjoy crafts, enjoy getting your hands dirty. Trying maybe I think someone is coming. I think someone is coming to see you. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> My pretty girls, I love them so much in our <laughs> lion head. <laughs> Hi, tiger. Hi, lion. <laughs> My girls, I love you so much, girls. Yeah, look at Emily's stones, Hanitka. What's that? Huh? Yeah, of course you wish to touch it and eat it maybe. You can smell it. Smell it, it's like a strawberry. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna wrap up at that guys and uh, invite you to watch uh, the tutorial, the watch the exercise, watch how we experiment today. And definitely I will much appreciate if you would let me know what you think about this idea. Is it actually something you looking forward to? Do you think it's needed, handy? And also uh, if you have some suggestions for the future videos about it, what techniques to try, maybe some funky project, something that will free up, free everyone else uh, who will be playing with this, uh, with this exercise. So unlock the art block. Use hashtag unlock the art block. <laughs> Hi, you can show it to everyone. Unlock the art block. Mm -hmm. And if you don't feel like it, if you don't know where to start, if you are just blocked, if you are feeling no mojo, please sit down, grab some tools, basic things around you and just 
do some fun things with me today. I promise you, you will love it, enjoy it. You have to start somewhere. That's the main thing. You have to start somewhere. So I'm looking at my <laughs> two, two princesses. I love them so much. Okay. Hannah. Let's say goodbye. I'll see you. Hannah, are you going to say goodbye to everyone with Emily? Go there and say goodbye. Come on. Will you say goodbye? No. Come here. Hodge. Hodge, my papa. papa. Do you want to say bye bye, Papa? She's kind of tanned. You both are tanned girls from being out. Bye! Happy crafting, everyone! Happy crafting. Blow kissy? Blow kissy. Blow kissy. <laughs> bye! Bye. Should I pause it? Oh. <laughs> ah, I will. Bye, guys. Bye. So what do we have here today? I have some envelopes. I have plenty, plenty, plenty envelopes that I have never used. Cards were used, but envelopes not so much. So I was thinking, why not to use envelopes for this exercise? Same way as we did, uh, I'm not sure if you remember, uh, art journal book from envelopes. If you haven't seen this video yet, uh, you have to check it out. I should be back to that journal book actually because it's fantastic. Maybe maybe I will. Maybe I will. I also have bubble wrap as you can tell uh, because I wish to do some simple marking, stamping, I don't know what but something super simple. Let's start with three envelopes and now if you don't have envelopes use what you have. Magazine, uh, paper, uh, please use um, uh, cardboard, please use chipboard, please use uh, printer, paper, anything. Anything you have in your house, in your studio, in your kitchens. Uh, don't feel uh, intimidated if you have not what I have. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. You don't have to. Okay. I also have paints. Those are three paints that I got some time ago and just those two are pretty new to me because I just got them this week. I couldn't help myself with those colors. I, th I, th I thought, mm -hmm -hmm. so what are we going to do with this bubble wrap? Look, Today's video is not about finishing project. It's not about. It's not about. Um, it's not about concentrating on perfection. Today's project is really for you to feel free, for you to feel something, uh, for you to feel good, for you to practice, for you to just try and start and play because. As the art block always go, often goes, we just don't feel like making anything. And I feel that if you're not going to try, you're not going to know, you're not going to fight it. But instead of concentrating on the project, on making this so much um, special, beautiful, perfect and finished, we are going to concentrate today on... Sorry for my sweater. <laughs> it's actually so short that it's hanging here. I'm going to make it longer. Um, Instead of concentrating on finished piece, we're going to concentrate on technique technique, or uh, on uh, practice, on having fun, on discovering, on doing silly things maybe. We are going to having fun and it's for you to break the block if you don't feel um, mojo is there, if you feel you are not inspired, if you feel that you don't feel like making anything specific. Perfect. <laughs> okay. I'm going to uh, glue this down because I think that's exactly what we may need to do. I will basically add some tape, double sided tape, and this will be my nice, this will be my tool for stamping. Why not? I've never done that actually, but there's tons of inspirations like that where uh, the bubble wrap is used and I think it's such a great idea so why not to simply do it okay and please this is not about perfection this is only to have fun um, I'm gonna squeeze some paints out and we're gonna start okay so let's squeeze some paints out I wonder if I have to open them I do indeed nice Nice, nice, nice. Nice to open a new product, isn't it? Now those are from Tiger. It's the this discount kind of store, funky store. 
uh, some countries have it I'm not sure if it's in states but um, I'm pretty sure it's in the UK is it uh, well in Ireland we have it and also in Poland we have it so yeah why not now I'm thinking to just leave it as it is and just I hope uh, do something and um, let's say I'm gonna grab my my roller thing a little bit with my nice with my paint now remember guys this is all for you to have fun nothing else we're not here to try to make anything uh, amazing we're here to just do some discoveries I hope now um oh <laughs> super cool now I'm using in I'm going in three but I'm gonna try to each time do something different so if I rolled it like that I'm gonna this time just do some stamping with it so the same tool but kind of something different so I'm stamping now and now what I'm gonna do is I will actually with this one I may actually just do this just do that ha ha okay what else we could do now I think we could certainly try to dip it in our I'll show you of course dip it in our circle in our um, our uh, roll into circle dip it in, in the sorry it's late hour maybe <laughs> I don't know cannot concentrate I actually am thinking about something pretty important to me maybe that's why so f please excuse me that so basically we're dipping in the paint our roll and we're trying to make some stamping there we go what else we could do we could do a little bit of oopsie we need more paint Marta we could do a little bit of painting with fingers why not mm-hmm painting with fingers so and same here and I'm just doing some some kind of maybe stamping stamps with my fingers going like that so simple exercise just to free your mind just to do something just to start because I think the problem is we don't start we look at other projects of other people's project and we don't start or we worry about finished project this is not about finished process here at all today this is for you to enjoy some creative time with yourself and with me so I'm gonna repeat that okay this is a very funny shape isn't it because it's not really circle it's like oval <laughs> that's okay oops that's fine that's fine that's fine now we also what else we could do with exactly the same thing let's just take that paint and let's just make some painting and stamping with this why not <laughs> now don't overthink just 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 be a child for a moment just just do it you know just do it just do it okay I'm gonna clean that off right away so I'm gonna get some wipe it's good to have bio wipes I think I'm gonna start investing in more natural wipes so they'd be more better for environment basically which would be great so now uh, by the way those are acrylics if you wonder what kind of paints are those those are acrylics so I'm gonna grab some white as well okay and directly from the tube I will just dab it dab it dab it here and there here and there okay not too much let's grab some darker now this time I'm thinking to use these neo colors uh, crayons those are wax I think those are are they waxy uh, wax pastels yes so why not to use those 
Um, what color will match? Maybe this blue would be nice. So I'm thinking to maybe just add some drawing in here. And I'm not, I don't mind that wet paint is wet. It's perfectly fine, you know. It's perfectly fine that the paint is wet. It's okay. You can go over actually your paint and mix it with that uh, pen, pen with that wax. Uh, pen um, crayon that's okay you know please don't worry now I have some paint as well there that's okay and I really wish this circle to be more circle and now I'm trying to be more free in it kind of so I'm deciding to where to just and I'm not overthinking here guys don't don't worry don't overthink done put it back Oops, <laughs> put it back. I'm gonna put this aside for now, for just two seconds. I think I need a little bit more marking, maybe a little bit more, not marking, but stamping. Maybe like this and here, just a little bit more. Maybe a different color, we'll see. Now, what else I can do? I have this wa wipe. What can I do? I can take it, there we go, and just and just play with this mm, water soluble wax pastels neo colors I can do same here so a little bit of mixing up oh that's nice here <clears throat> super looks already each each piece different and if I hold it like that or like that it doesn't matter to me now what else we can do we can do some other color what about the red I rarely use red how about going as well here again it's wet things are wet around it that's okay and I'm not holding my 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 crayon too properly I really don't mind that it's not properly hold it by me it's fine <clears throat> now uh, where I tried to do the the stamps with my fingers <laughs> it didn't work so I just redo that with my crayon I can actually do this now now don't be precise like that this is what I would normally do but I'm actually holding it now like a child would hold it you know super I love that so it's quite organic if that's the right word to use it's quite organic and I love, love that I just looked at the camera with the fear that I'm not recording but I am which I'm glad to okay I love that I'm putting back my crayons and I'm gonna grab some black because I think black would be nice if we are able to actually maybe play with it a little bit wow look haha <laughs> completely different colors now we have and now the, the envelopes as you can imagine those are not um, those are not uh, what's the word those are not primed or anything I didn't prime I'm not about priming here I'm, I'm about to having fun here I'm about to I'm, I'm wetting my fingers so things can just flow easier so I'm just about to having fun and just to kind of um, see where this takes me you know that kind of attitude and no we're not precise here no we're not priming the project we just go with the flow <laughs> and dabbing like a child basically abstract art oh why not <laughs> I really love that and you know what I think no matter what age you are no matter what uh, experience you have you can certainly do that you know this is the beauty of it you can no I don't like that color I think I'm gonna stick with that orange orange red very funny not not necessarily together but you know what a different kind of a different kind of um, I'm filling the gaps here a different kind of um, why not Wow, this is just going into some kind of direction that, wow. 
I like that. I love that actually, I should say. Oh yeah, no. What about if instead uh, my wet wipe, I'm gonna use brush with water and just, huh? there we go, and just go with some water, nice. Wow. That is so strange to me. It's so different, you know. But I was, um, I, as I said, the idea came from from you, because I know I I when when I posted that video and lots of you said you helped me to break that creative block to to stop the creative block and I was like wow such a great actually idea to break the block how many of you have a creative block maybe I should do something about it and that's where I thought simple exercises not so uh, magical journal pages as such but actually exercises rather than uh, concentration on finished piece you know so that's where the whole idea came from you again <laughs> yet again from you and I love that now I'm dabbing with my with my paint here and there here and there and that's so nice I love that <laughs> I love that it, I'm actually tempted to finish off all of that because I love it so much and it could be nice Um what we could do is we could dry that and see what's gonna happen I found this leftover, literally leftover, and I thought, why not? Why not to just simply use it and add it somewhere? And we may actually <laughs> end up with finished project. The plan was not like that, but let's see. Let's see, look, we're not here to... Uh, we can always change our mind, isn't it? <laughs> it looks already super cool, and the color by accident match so very well so why not we may have this fun together now I can use the smaller uh, smaller punch if possible let's see let's see let's see if I can actually do that whoopsie okay maybe I need to free this and try here. Oops, that's okay. Half circle, it's fine as well. Circles are great exercise. That's it. Anywhere, all the time, for everyone. Okay, let's glue this down. So we need some print stick. Mm, I didn't find the print stick, but I have this office school glue that I think should work fine so let's do it let's do that so you will see like with uh, how one how one uh, kind of project can turn into as in same same techniques can turn into different looking pieces you know all together it doesn't want to stick. That's okay. I'm tempted to actually use some en um, not envelope, but to actually use some uh, what you call it stapler. But also, um, I'm thinking, and I lost it. What I was thinking, I lost it. Totally lost it. Like magazines, I thought, but I can still do that, isn't it? I'm not too sure I'm a fan of the small circles. Let's see the magazine. Mm, I don't have actually magazines, <laughs> too many magazines, because I simply I use computer. So, but I can try. And I have some green here. Ha ha. And I have some green here. Uh huh. And I have some green too. And the green. Mm. Oh, lots of green here actually. So, this could be it. This could be so fabulous. So, let's add the magazine here. Mm -hmm. Wow. 
<laughs> wow, but simple, but I love that, you know. I really love that. Okay, maybe here. This one. No, I'm not worried about precision. I'm not worried about that something is standing out. We'll try and we'll try to work it and fix it. And that's, you know, relax. Relax. Nothing is sticking out. I think it's the glue, but that's okay. I'm going to put something heavy on top and it will be fine. I hope. <laughs> I hope. But probably gel medium would work better. But I'm just trying to, you know, have this vision of not so professional thing. Where's my roller? Yay! <laughs> oh! That would be fun if I can actually. I'm gonna put this on top of each other and we need something super heavy. Uh, that would be fun if I just use my brayer on top of that now. Oh, it's a little bit wet still, so let's dry this and I'm gonna be back to you. And before it dries, I will attach it with some stapler. Haha. <laughs> Hello. There we go. Gorgeous so. Everywhere. A little bit here, a little bit there. Why not? It's not only that it's holding a project, but it's also nice when it just adds this extra something to it. Okay. So, I'm thinking, it's still wet, it didn't dry, that's okay. I'm thinking to go with that red again, for example. Imagine now going with that red here with those circles so this all will be one happy family with colors and all I guess mm -hmm. oops that's okay now uh -huh. and yes it looks very very messy it looks that something is not there kind of like not so nice it's okay we we don't mind we love that that it's not so great now next thing or last thing pencil i love adding pencil as well because pencil we can rub it nicely oh if it's if it's working this one doesn't want want to cooperate with us uh, where's my other pencil? This one is charcoal. It should work. Why is it not working? Let's see the other one. Ah! Oh, it works here on top. Not on the wet surface. But that's okay. I can still try to use that. Around. Oh yeah, it works like now. So definitely have a look. My lines are wobbly. This is no uh, nowhere to be perfect. That's okay. And I'm on top of my circles. It didn't go around it like the red one. Fine. Because of the wax crayon for definite. I go on top. You know, if they won't let you this way, go some other way. Make your own way, guys. So... So simple. So imperfect and I bet with you uh, when you do it you will have exactly the same exactly <laughs> completely sorry completely different uh, the th thing, thing to me completely different so use the color paint you have super and you know just stick with what you have if you have rectangular shape punch super that's that's fine no, I love that. And what else we can do? Now I think adding a little bit of white here and there will just help it to, you know, blend in like the magazine, for example. Even if you will go on top of your, um, on top of your, um, the metal thing, that's fine. That's okay. You can do that for sure. So we're just blending in now. If there is something you kind of don't like, <laughs> it's it's good to cover it with white. <laughs> it's 
so so how is that I love that I love that now what about if I actually do some something on my brayer what will happen oh how is that nice so a little bit on of my brayer a little bit of paint <sighs> love it love you ha 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 and lastly on this one maybe wow that is cool you have to say it. that is so cool vertically horizontally <laughs> anywhere everywhere perfect I'm loving that now I will wipe off my brayer just <laughs> so it would be pretty okay like and we can do a little bit of doodle let's say like doodle here around the circle it's not doing well because everything is wet I'm not waiting for things to dry it's not even surface even the envelope itself it's really difficult because it's so soft but I'm trying to show you that even on the not so great surface like envelope you can still do the magic so I'm just making more like a marks than <laughs> drawing that's okay that's okay I'm, I'm gonna maybe just be a little crazy here as well now I think it what would be handy would be to have some kind of uh, marker that would go on top of all of that like Posca maybe would go on top of that I don't know possibly so now this definitely doesn't draw anymore it's okay a little bit if it's possible to be done a little bit super like now okay <laughs> um, but if not this I'm pretty sure we could do that with our karandashi haha <laughs> you see you can do that with this crayon karandashi is the wax crayon that we used okay that's not bad so don't overthink just just run with your hands and just do things however your heart tells you you know if it tells you this awesome if not do something else now we have some white here mm, what about some yellow about some touches of yellow this is pretty crazy isn't it <laughs> such a different uh, thing let's see I love 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 them you know what now to finish off what I would do is normally <laughs> I would stick some butterfly uh, to it um, but no I, I want maybe some splashes uh, let's do some splashes Mm, I have this uh, stamp with a date so I'm gonna actually use that and date it a bit it's the 6th of June when you are watching that it's probably not 6th of June well it's definitely not 6th of June it's probably like a week later or so and you know what I'm going a little bit of crazy here why not so I have my stamper haha -ha cool cool okay that's it we could stamp something else couldn't we what we could stamp mm, I have this little uh, foamy thing and, and I have also Hannah here <laughs> and oh look at that cool stamp no way this is beyond awesome now be careful because uh, you may destroy your ink somehow if you are touching this uh, maybe use some old ink if you're touching this on the wet surface this is so cool now I love that yeah Hannah is trying to of course come in here and that is coming to the rescue not to, not to allow, allow, allow her I bring her when I finish we nearly finish actually 
how cool is that so this is a <laughs> the little little thing from the stamping from the sticker from 3d sticker wow I th <laughs> I think it's so cool you could actually make some kind of pattern it's like a proper stamp look at that now love it okay so goodbye now I'm gonna put you away I don't want you for now and I have my rubber can I stamp with my rubber yes I can yes I can <laughs> see look what's around you guys just <laughs> break that fear of that things won't work they hi. will work hi they will work you just have to believe it and try and that's it you know you just have to try it guys you just have to try to break this, this this creative block that you have in your mind it's more in your mind than anywhere else hey Emily's coming home so I think finally I will maybe add some touches of paint lastly I think like like so uh -huh. wow um, I had no vision at all and plan of what we're gonna have when it's finished but I love what I see and I hope that you tried this being a child a little bit with me I really hope you did a little bit of messy but oh well I love that I love that <laughs> I am actually quite surprised of the final result of that. We lost a little bit of stamping. Well, we have here. We can still do some stamping. Let's see if I can actually still do some stamping. Let's see. Ha. Huh. There we go. Some bit of stamping. There we go. Super cute. Super, super cute. I think we need some white splashes. Okay, so I have some white paint here and water diluted with water I think I need a little bit more so let's get some white ah. come on I need some more and doesn't work so I'm gonna maybe grab oh, some more acrylic and some water you can hear Emily and Hannah because Emily is back as well ah. And someone, well, many of you actually recently said that you miss Emily. Uh, so you can say hello, Emily, if you. Hi. Hi. Hello. <laughs> hello. Everyone misses you from my videos, Honey Bunny. Oh, there we go. We have some white splashes. Splashes, splashes. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's the joys of. <laughs> of having a toddler around the house this is her recent vocalization <laughs> that's what it is okay I think we can call them finished mm, they're not meant to be final pieces and they're really not but I'm gonna add it anyway this one is a dreamer this one is choose to shine look I'm not even thinking where I'm where I'm playing when 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 I'm putting th where I'm putting that and trust in your heart I'm not concentrating when I'm putting this I'm just I'm not thinking as you could see so that's that's the kind of plan don't overthink just play with it just do it so here it is <laughs> and it's a simple exercise something very easy very freely for you to just break your routines and just discover something new I really hope you liked it and enjoyed it enjoyed it and the most important please 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 do try promise me that you will try it because that's the main thing so thank you so much I wish you a, a many creative moments and uh, happy crafting see you soon bye bye bye